this is Andy from Walt Motor Company in Newbury and welcome to the sale of this 2015-15 registered uh, Range Rover Evoque. So the 2.2 litre engine, the much more reliable 2.2 litre engine in this car. Dynamic, dynamic Lux model, if I can get my teeth in. Very nice car indeed, finished in Inda Silver, black leather interior. Um, this car has covered 51,000 miles. So getting harder to find them with nice low mileages on. Oh, it's horrifying to think that this is already nine years old, but there you go. She's been serviced by Land Rover 10 times in her life. Um, very nice clean example of these cars. Very nice spec indeed. Got the panoramic roof, obviously leather, got heated seats. Um, she's got the camera system. She's got digital radios and on lights, etc. Uh, rear camera, parking sensors. So the whole nine yards, very nice spec vehicle. Got the black grille, black bumper, etc. Black mirrors, black badges. And as I say, in really nice all round condition. Drives all as it should, obviously. So let's have a closer look around the vehicle. Driver's door card in excellent condition. Driver memory seat, four electric windows, electric mirrors. This car has the Meridian sound system, has illuminated Range Rover kick plate, has the electric seat mechanism buttons. And then looking at the condition of the driver's seat, in very good order, minimal wear to the bolster. Leather looks better as it gets older, doesn't it? And this one does have a leather steering wheel. The steering wheel itself is in very good order all the way around. I mention it because of hand sanitizers, etc. It does deteriorate leather. On the left hand side of the wheel, you'll see your computer controls and telephony. On the right hand side, cruise control. Car does have paddle gear shift. And if we look down into the center of the dash, if we can get some focus, current mileage is 51187. So if I bring my long leg in, push the button, you'll see that she starts straight away. No warning lights on the dash that shouldn't be there, except the fact that I've got the door open. Shut that door, stop the binging. So across to the center console, your push button starts up there. In here we've got digital radio. We are indoors, so that's not going to work very well color satellite navigation um, if we go to extra features you'll see we can go into our camera settings gives you views all around the car with the camera which is quite cool I'm not sure if that was standardized by this stage or whether it was an option um, you tell me so all the right features in there if I pop the car into reverse see the reverse camera so all good moving down got your CD player here three stage heated seats dual zone climate control there's your rotor gearbox and drive modes etc I've hidden the keys just in here there's two keys for it the center console in very good condition no marks there left from elbows and then the passenger seat Again, in very good order. Passenger door card and the dashboard, the plastics, everything you come into contact with in very good condition. Driver's side rear door card, again, in excellent condition. I do like the white stitching that you find around the car. It does break it up nicely and on the seats there. Rear seats, again, in absolutely lovely condition. Head restraints are present backs of the front seats in good order and there's a good view of the panoramic roof so um, fixed roof but with a cover should you want to close it all in lovely condition in the back there into the boot area nice clean space you'll see that it's got 60-40 uh, split rear seats the carpet area all in good order I don't wouldn't suggest this car's had a hard life at all got the um, uh, you know the boot cover the load cover in the back and magic tailgate down she goes electric 
Starting away around the bodywork with the near side front corner. All looks to be in good order. Good tyres all round on the car. Near side front alloy wheel is perfect. Looking along the passenger side of the car, including the mirror cap. I can't see any obvious dinks, dents or scratches along there. Offside rear wheel, some light um, corrosion around the valve cap. Tiny little chip on the wheel there. Around this corner all looks good. Um, across the back, all looks nice. Around this corner is all good. Your offside rear wheel, perfect. And then along the driver's side of the car, just trying to catch anything, you know, in the light. This is why I do it this way. I can't, again, see any obvious dinks, dents or scratches. This car does have the proximity lock-in, so you can lock and unlock it without getting the keys out. Mirror cap's fine. Uh, offside front wheel. Perfect. Around this corner... There's a little stone chip there been touched in. There's got to be a couple of little stone chips, but nothing significant. A couple of little stone chips on the bonnet here. That's just water marks from cleaning. So yeah, not too much to remark on there. A couple more little chips just up here. Up onto the windscreen tiny bit of road rash every car has it up on the roof's all good so yeah we're down to very minute detail criticizing this car very very clean and tidy example indeed so there we go 2015 Range Rover Evoque uh, 2.2 engine Land Rover history 51,000 miles very low mileage vehicle very nice condition as you've seen in the video Nice spec again, um, I'll just highlight a couple more bits. Um, the panoramic roof, xenon lights, cameras all round, dab radio, you know, that heated seats, that kind of thing. You've seen it all in the video anyway. Really nice car. I keep saying that, you know, they're not making any more of these, so mileage is only ever going up. So low mileage ones like this are getting fewer and far between. If you'd like to come see the car, she's in Newbury and Berkshire, do give me a ring. My name's Andy, 07786. 742422. Thank you for watching the videos.